Hello guys, welcome back to our channel and welcome to another video in Python Tally series. In this video, I am going to show you how to get ledger vouchers from Tally using Python and Flask framework. Let's start this video. This is the example payload which we have to send to Tally for getting ledger vouchers. In this payload, we are telling Tally to type its data as the ledger vouchers is a kind of report in Tally. And then ID is the name of the report name which already exists in Tally that is ledger vouchers. Then the static variables we are telling Tally the export format is XML. Then we are telling the ledger name that we want a list of vouchers. So we are using ledger name tag and setting it to sales. So then I am using export vnum for getting voucher numbers along with the request. Then I am modifying the ledger vouchers report and setting from date and to date to get vouchers in that particular period. So this is the XML request we have to send to Tally for getting ledger vouchers. So let's do it in Python. This is the Python code and this is a simple web application built using Flask framework. And here I have two routes, one is index route where I am rendering the template called rom.html. Inside this rom.html, I have three inputs for getting from date, to date and ledger name and the submit button. Then in the second route, ledger statement, I am getting the inputs from the previous route and then constructing an XML request and sending it to tally. And finally, I am rendering a template called ledger statement.html which contains the data for the particular ledger. So now let's see how it works. So this is how the application looks like. So in the home page, which is in next page, we have inputs for get entering from date and to date and also the ledger name. So let's enter from date and to date. So I'm entering from date as 1-4-2020 and then to date as 1-5-2020. Then I'm entering the ledger name to sales which are which is already existing tally. So then click on submit button. So you can see we got the list of vouchers for this particular ledger. We have date, particulars that is ledger name and voucher type, voucher number, debit amount, credit amount. So I will show you in tally. So we got these three vouchers into our Python application. Okay guys, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please do like, share, subscribe our channel and stay tuned for the next video.